This video is a feedback about Raspberry Pi camera eavesdropping attack. I have used the CMAX Executor Dragon OS because it was already compiled with the Tempest SDR with all the modules. I've tried several times with issues to compile even with Akiref libraries for the EMI. Actually, you could use the Tempest SDR, I would say the regular one, not the customized here. Maybe it will help me in the future. I just ha didn't have any SDR that was like already uh, taken into account with the presets they made. So I skip that part and I use the one from CMAX. So Actually here, I didn't have to compile, but what I wanted to show you here is all the settings that is actually worth looking at it. So for me, it was quite a mix of everything. Like if you have already watched before the video where I was doing the Tempest on my HDMI cable. So that might be related to the environment where um, there is a lot of noise, maybe the settings, the kind of antenna here, the SDR, I was able to use fortunately a better one, the Blade ERF. And the settings that was quite working, you will see later in the video, was from the Raspberry Pi Model 3 with the module one and my module is one to three so i still understand that it's module one and from the fps it's totally odd and more um, close to 60 rather than uh, the 30 here um, advertised and from the frequency i'm here well um, around one gigahertz so if you would like to do the same, like, please keep this in consideration. And I would be also curious for people that have like better results than me, what I'm doing, like maybe I'm just clicking around, not getting um, what it means, but the signal was quite here, you, you will see it. So CMAX in his video made the test with a wise cam, so I, I would like to have such camera here that was like um, uh, tested and sorted with uh, specific settings because for me for the Raspberry Cam module I'm using an SPI cable with like 30 centimeters length so I'm not sure if that's helped more or less and the camera is really uh, close to the antenna with the cable as well so yeah, one in one. All the tests would be nice as well as to have like smartphone, but unfortunately I don't have those. So yeah, and um, that's the kind of settings uh, you you will get if you use um, the Tumper, um, Tempest SDR from uh, EMI's uh, repository. And um, yeah, let's uh, deep dive into into the test now. Hey, here's a proof of concept. So we have the blade ref with an antenna from Great Scott just close by the SPA cable for the Raspberry Pi camera. So it's plugged and maybe let's say a few centimeters away and from there like I'm doing the tempest so if i could say hi here you see me okay and I, I really struggle so for using tempest there is a pre-compiled version dedicated for all the camera but i had a really hard time either using the akiref or even the blade ref don't mention it because I need to recompile it and I was wasting a lot of nights doing this so I just gave up and I went straight with the Tempest ADR 
that came with uh, Dragon OS. So thanks for for this. And yeah, I, I looked as in the previous video where I was looking for radiation from a screen, and we could see it's working um, pretty okay. So of course it's not perfect. Maybe I'm missing uh, some uh, some stuff. So here I'm going to refresh also um, the video from the Raspberry Pi and as you can see if I show let's say here's a logo from the channel here you could see also on the Tempest um, SDR so right now you're going to tell me yes um, you know you put the antenna just close by the wire but I think this already means a lot if let's say you are able to access to a lot of wire and you come with this kind of setup so you could really eavesdrop anything so my next idea is to try this on my doorbell I don't know how it works where I'm living you know if it's radio but I really highly doubt and most likely it's a wire chip uh, uh, product so maybe I could like get something um, similar as here and unless I have already find let's say some information online it will be really to trial and error look every um, uh, frequency because there is a lot of noise in my place and yeah it will take time so stay tuned and I'm happy to share this uh, new experiment with you.